What's up everybody? Welcome back to my Ratchet and Clank HD Let's Play. In today's video, we will be getting all the golden bolts. Now, I'm doing this on my first playthrough. After I beat the first boss, you just kind of continue instead of um, going into New Game Plus because you need all of your gadgets and stuff that you collected throughout the Let's Play. That's also why I waited for the very end. So, uh, yeah. Of course, we are going to start on the first planet here. We're going to go in order on planet Novalis. And I'll probably show you where they all are from like the start of the mission. Just so no one gets like confused on where we are. So you're, you're going to want to make it into this room and then jump up this little double wall thing back and forth. And it should be right up here. All right, bolt number two from the start from our ship. There's going to be this little area behind us. Um, you're going to want to go this way. Also, um, if you look at your map, there's like these little green areas that you get from whenever you get the uh, map o -matic in the story and it shows you all the secret areas. So normally there's going to be a golden bolt there. So I already opened this, but you're going to want to open this door by unscrewing this or screwing it, whatever. <laughs> I think it's screwing it in, but and then make your way through this little uh, cave. Um, you can fight all the people if you want. I'm not going to. Just to make this kind of go faster. Oh god. I held square too much. Anyways. So nice swimming with this thing instead of like swimming without it. And then you're gonna want to make your way down here. Just jump down here. Clear out the enemies. Once again, I went through this stuff in my playthrough and just didn't collect it. But right here, there should be a wall here. And all you gotta do is select your bomb or just anything that blows up, I guess. And then just toss at the wall and it'll blow up the wall. And behind it will be the uh, golden bolt. All right, bolt number three from the start. You're going to want to head all the way down here as if you're playing the actual uh, mission or planet, whatever. And once again, you can fight all these things if you want. I'm just going to rush past everything, which I'm probably going to be doing throughout this whole video. And once you get here, here see here is where you would need the uh, faster swimming thing because you need to jump this water and basically swim against this current. If you don't have this, I don't think you can actually do this. I think the current will be too strong and push you back. So like, while I have it, it's still pretty slow, which sucks. But once you get here, jump up to the right over here. And this is where that green area was on the map. So up there is just some boxes you can grab if you want, but you you can see it up there. But you're going to want to make your way over here down this little tunnel. And then make a sharp right. And there is going to be this wall that you can climb up. And you just hop up here and grab the bolt. All right, we're on to the next planet, Kerwan. There's going to be three bolts here from the start. You want to go just pretty much straight forward. And then basically you just want to jump off the ledge here and kind of just hover down into this little area. I think you might be able to die if you get hit by one of the flying car things. I'm not too sure, but yeah, it's right here. Okay, so for this next one, you're going to want to take a left up here from the start into this little like whatever course thing that you go through. Um, also, I'm not going to be showing every little thing just because it'll make this video forever. So I'll probably skip until I get to the top here. But uh, yeah, you're going to want to get to the top of that tower over there. So I will be back when I get there. All right, I just made up here. Pretty straightforward. Here's this little jumping thing. And you'll want to come over here to this like open ledge. And it's going to be in this building down there where you see those crates. So basically just do a little dash forward and then glide down there. This really feels like something that would be like a glitch, like an out of map kind of thing, which is stuff that I love. And as you can see, it's right there, right after I break some leaves. All right, let's go grab it.
All right. For this next one, the last one on this planet, right after you get your clank upgrade, I believe it was, from the guy down there, um, you're going to want to continue towards where the uh, train is. Um, this is like following the actual mission, by the way, so that's why I kind of skipped ahead to it. Because you're going to have to come here no matter what. But uh, you're going to want to make your way up this elevator. And then just continue towards the train. I'm just going to try to skip all these guys. As long as it lets me. Yeah, lots of enemies here. You might want to fight them. There's a lot. <laughs> Did not realize there was that many. Okay. And then make your way up this little escalator. Escalator? Blah. Can't speak. And then hurry up and get up here. And you can probably see it over there. You just want to stay on top of all these boxes. And then boom, you got it. On to the next planet. Now we're on planet Aridia, and the first one is going to be during like the main mission area where you're like slingshotting through all the stuff. And once you get to the circular room, all you want to do is glide down right under here and grab this. All right, second one is over here, top right of the map. Once you're at this little crash site over here, just take a left and you can walk up these walls once you get the magnetized boots. And once you get up here, let me off, please. There we go. <laughs> I don't know why I was stuck. Just head inside here and there's another one right here. Alright, once again, come from this little crash site here, you're gonna wanna backtrack a little bit to where you like came out of here. And get on top of this and then get over to this land. Uh, I don't know if there's another way to do that or like an actual way to do that, but that's how I do it. And then on top of this truck is another bolt. This next one is going to be right where you meet the uh, skater dude. You're just going to make your way to the left over here. Until you get to this little metal grate. And then... Oh, that's not... Oh, I thought that's what you do. Hold on. Give me a second. Oh, okay. You have to keep running this way. I misread what the guide said. Boom. There we go. <laughs> My bad. I guess that just gives you a little sneak peek of where it is. All right, now we're on planet Eudora's, I think is how you say it. Anyways, here from the start, past this uh, buy station. Uh, probably clear out these enemies. I don't know. You don't have to. And then I think you need to equip uh, your helipad instead of the boosters. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Oops. You just want to do a normal like big jump like this, grab onto the ledge, and then grab the bolts. All right, now we're on Nebula G34. Well, the first one, you want to come to the left over here from the star and enter the area that was clank only before. But now that we got this helmet, Ratchet can go outside. Let me out. All right. So you want to... You're going to... Uh, nah, do that. All right. I had problem problem speaking right there and jumping. Anyways, you're going to want to go up this little path. It's a tiny little path because it was made for clank, not Ratchet. And then from here, you just want to jump across here and it's around this little corner. All right, next one going along with the story, taking the right path this time. Once you get to this first uh, like circle area where the buy station is, you're going to want to make your way up to the second level up here. Don't know how I just did that. And then go to the second to last area. And as you can see, it is right there.
Now we are on planet Wilgar, I think is how it's pronounced. I don't know. Anyways, we're going to want to make our way over here towards this little elevator. That was by the uh, race area, by the way, so you could just take the taxi from the beginning to that area. Hop off here. And once you come out here, there's going to be this uh, thing that gets blown into the air, like a sewage cap thing. I don't even know what to call it. And from here, you want to jump on to this little area, the ledges of this uh, laser maze kind of thing, whatever you want to call it. And just run along here. And as you can see it right there, it is in the back right. I almost just fell. So for this next bolt, it'll be right here on the map. You'll be you go through here during the missions, but you can't get it during the mission. You have to get, have the O2 mess for it. And it's going to be where that green area is on the map. Oh, I didn't go far enough. So, yeah, now you can breathe as much as you want down here. Let's make your way through here. And I think it'll be right around this area ish. Uh, yeah, it's down here. Okay. So make your way through this like pipe tube, whatever you want to call it. And then you're going to be in like this. I don't even know. Acidic kind of water. It looks kind of like greenish almost. And it is right up here. All right, now we're on planet Umbris, and you're going to want to make it to this area where you got to swing or not swing necessarily. Whoops. Don't have that thing equipped. You want to get across here to this little bridge area. And then from here, you're going to want to make your way to this little area over here and hit all of these buttons in order. Or at least by the time limit. And that shall open the door. Go backwards a little bit. Oh yeah, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. And then enter this building and the golden bolt will be right there. All right, once you get to this area, like kind of middle-ish, I guess, where the lurker sharks are, you're going to want to jump down here. I guess kill them. And then at this second area, once you get up these stairs, you're going to want to look over the edge. Just make sure at the right area, which I believe I am, and then jump down here and you'll get the golden ball right here. Now we're on planet Batalia and from the beginning of the level, you're going to want to go just just go straight to these two buildings pretty much and then go to this left one right here and you're going to be able to jump between these two walls to lead up to here and to grab the golden bolt. All right, for the next one, once you're around this area, you should fight a tank going across this bridge. Uh, I'm going to grab this health real quick. I don't think I'll need it, but just in case. And then to the right of this building, just make your way up these steps and then Kind of fly your way across here. Over these boxes and then around this corner and the golden bolt is right there. All right, now we're on to the next planet to planet Gasper. For this one, you're going to want to turn around and then come to this little right path. I didn't even like touch this area during my playthrough just because this is mainly just for this bolt and uh, skill point. So pretty much you just make your way to the end of this area for the skill point. You're going to want to release all these ships, but I'm not doing that just yet. I'm going to do a separate video for that. We will have to like break some of them though, like this one for instance that's in the way. But it creates a uh, slingshot thing, I believe. Yeah. And these things. I don't know if these were there before. I ran into the boxes. Oops. And yeah, you just want to make your way to the end of this little uh, 
I don't even know what to call it. Platforming area? <laughs> I don't know. And uh, I didn't let go late enough. I went too early. All right, made it back here. Gotta remember not to release early this time. <laughs> All right, let's make it over here and continue along the path. Once again, gonna keep this one here for the uh, skill point uh, video, but this one we're gonna have to to blah, blah, have to destroy. If it'll destroy. Thank you. see it's over there in order to get to it we do have to free all four of these ones uh, which is kind of unfortunate because it's only gonna leave me a few of these to destroy once it comes to the skill point uh video but we gotta do it in fact it probably would have been better if i just did that video before this one but too late now we're already like halfway done with it This next one is very close to the start. It's just once you cross where the ship is, you take a left and go up this little hill and then up this elevator. And from up here, let me just break these real quick. You're gonna wanna jump into this big hole to the left. Now there's gonna be a lot of enemies in here. It would be good if you have the rhino, which I don't have yet because I just haven't done that. But I got the bomb. Get away. Yeah, lots of enemies. And I might die here. If I could just run past the rest of these guys without getting hit, I can get there. Just make it to this elevator. Okay, I made it, surprisingly, with one hit left. <laughs> and then up here to the left on this little ledge over here. Oh, I wasn't close enough. Or, yeah. All right, now we're on planet Orxon, and for the first one, you're gonna wanna go into the area that uh, Clank went through. Now we can go through with a ratchet. I actually don't know the exact area, so I might get lost here. I just know that it's somewhere around here. Like, I think it might have been this way, where that little green speck is on the map. Maybe not. Let me actually, like, hook this up real quick. Okay, so I'm back where I was. I was going the right way. It's just right up here in this little sewer area, and then in this little area right here, you just jump your way up, and it's right there. Okay, for the next one, you're going to want to go up this little elevator right behind Ratchet's uh, ship right there, and you can see it up there, but first, I don't have it equipped. Hold on. Or we're, we're gonna want to use the visible bomb gun. I can't speak right now. And pretty much shoot it into this area. I don't know if you need to use this. Like you could just use, you might be able to use like normal explosives. But yeah. You're gonna have to blow up all these little walls. Ooh, okay, I'm gonna pause until I do this. All right, finally got it after many, many tries. 
you're gonna want to make your way towards the ratchet route now. I'll be back once I get to the little split area. All right, from this buy point, you're gonna want to take the right route. I'm probably gonna die here, especially by these guys. Ooh, go, go, go. And I died by myself. Never mind. No. Come on, game. What the? Why do you go? There we go. That's how I made it. Okay. So once you get here, it's going to be to your left right here. It's kind of hidden around the corner, but you know it's there, then you know it's there. Going to make your way through all of this that you just opened up pretty much with the Visibomb. I wonder if I'm like inside of a creature or something like that, because like it looks like this is like stomach acid or something like that. All right, we should be almost there. Yep, there it is. All right, on to the next one. Now we're on planet Pokotaru, and it's going to be in that green area right there. So pretty much from the start, you're just going to want to make your way to this little sandy area over here. Actually, it might be faster just to like go straight in here. And there should be a little opening to our left into a little cave. Yep. And then swim up and jump out of the water. Uh, little warning this uh, bolt has a bunch of enemies so just be aware of that be ready to fight them all or just run past them if you want to but might be a little bit easier for you if you just kill them now especially if you're like me and don't have all of your upgrades yet oh god Yep, I'm gonna die. Dude, it's these little freaking orange guys. Forgot they're not one hit. Really, can I not throw a bomb up there? Thank you. There we go. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get that guy with one now. No, I died. All right, made it back here. Nice. Almost there. Almost there. Oh god, I don't know if I'll be able to actually get this now. I blew up the boxes right here. Please let me get this game. No. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna have to like try some things out. Okay, I made it up here. You, I turned on my helipad and from here... Did that. And out there. Now we're on planet Hoven, and the first one is going to be at this like little right area where that green is. From the start, it's just going to be straight. Just dodge all these guys, go behind the tree, and you see that moving platform right there? You're going to have to wall jump between that and this uh, wall right here. Oh, I missed it. Go, 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 go. Uh oh. Dude. <laughs> Get away from me. There we go. Got that time. All 
All right, for the next one, you're going to be want to be in this area. You're going to go here during the main mission, and it's going to be the area where you fill this up. After you fill it up, you're going to want to dive back in here and then go into where you got the uh, third water from, and then just swim up, and the golden bolt will be up here. All right, next is Atlantis Orbit. And once you get to this area on the map, which once again, it's kind of a linear map. So like you're going to get here no matter what. Just once you recognize this area, this is going to be this acid coming up. Nah, I'm going to wait for next cycle. I could have made that, but I got scared. All right, now we can go. Once you get to this platform, you turn to your left and you'll see it right there. You will be able to just blast your way across or do that. That works too. And there you go. All right, now we are on planet blah, 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 planet Atlantis. Blah, can't speak. And we're right here. You take the ice path and you'll eventually get here. And as you can see, it is right over there. So you just go right around this little corner and then just drop down. All right, the next one is literally like right across this little ice thing from the other one. Once you get to this part where you have to like cross uh, this little wall. Um, instead of getting up right here where you're supposed to go, you can keep on going past this area. Normally when there's stuff like this on like these walls like this, it normally like stops you, but here it doesn't. All right, the next one, you're going to want to be here near the beginning. This will open up like once you actually like finish this place, but it'll unlock these uh, slingshot things and you just want to follow the path all the way to the end. Oh, I almost just let go too early there. All right. Everyone turn to the right or left, I mean. And he's too far. Get it. That's a little scary. If you don't time it right, then uh, you die. What the heck is this? Oh, it looks like a robot or something. <laughs> Where am I going? All right, once again, a little sketchy. Uh, I think I'm waiting for another one, yeah. All right, and we made it. The last one here, you take the little route that brings you to like these uh, rails, grind rails. And, but once you're here, you see that little green sl uh, sliver on the map? It's going to be up there. So you're going to need the uh, swing shot too. Oh God. And it's going to be right up here. All right. Now we're on planet Quartu. And you're going to want to go to the area where you originally enlarged Clank over to the left over here. And there's going to be this little secret code thing here. I don't think you can get this like right at the beginning of the level. I think you get that uh, gadget like a little bit later. But yeah, it's behind all these boxes right here. Definitely don't have to break them, but I did. For this next one, you're going to want to come up to where you met uh, Frank's mother, actually. And if you look up, there's that thing right there. So just swing up there and then go through this little pipe and it will be right here. All right, now we're on planet Kalebo 3. Probably butchered that name. And you're going to come up here to this little grind rail section. And I'll be where the first uh, 
Golden Bolt is. Oh boy. Anyone who watched my actual like playthrough of this knows I had a great time on these. <laughs> I don't know. I was just playing very bad when it came to this section. Where I just got distracted by something in the water, which happened during the playthrough. I died so many times on here. One of them was because I got distracted by a thing in the water. That's such a weird angle to jump over that. Alright, so you're we're gonna want to make sure you hit all these little target things that you uh Cross. Anyone make sure you get onto this little right section, because this is where the last two uh, targets are. All right, hit that one as you pass. You're gonna hit it on the back swing. Ow! Didn't jump. And then the last one is right past these little zigzags. All right. I feel like you have to time those like perfect. Oops! Failed again. Jump over here, and then make sure you jump at the end right here, otherwise you fall into the water. Alright, now we have to get past this little section, and then you're gonna want to jump to the right again, I believe. Oh god, almost forgot about that one. Er, is it tonight? Yeah. This little section. I believe. I could be wrong, but I think so. I'm just doing this based off of memory of my uh, playthrough. So hopefully this is right. Get out of my way, buster. Dude, it's so laggy here for me. I don't know why. Okay, yeah, there it is. All right. On to the next one. All right, once you get here, it's right after the track, so you can pretty much get this right after the last one. You want to come over here, like, b below the track, and there's a cell bar that you want to take to the employee's, like, break room or something like that. And it will be sitting right here with a bunch of chickens. <laughs> All right, next we're on Velden Orbit, and it's going to be in that little green area right there. It's right off the bat. You go to where the electrocuting water is. And it's going to be near the end. So we'll just get there real quick. Uh, my nose is itching. All right. Just try not to get hit by anything because uh, I don't think it's that tight of a timer, but I don't know. As long as you get out of the water in time, we're fine. I also don't know if this is like an insta kill kind of thing if you run out of time or if it like shocks you first and then you die kind of thing but I don't plan to find out now all right almost there oh oh I just did two times in a row nice hopefully I have time to get there now okay so once you get to these three things Light them up, and then you're going to want to turn around and not go through the normal door. Because then this door back here opens behind you. Oh, we have plenty of time. Come up here. And then just make sure you hop out of the water before it electrocutes you again and grab this. Alright, for this next one, it's going to be right after the space area where you like destroy the birds and stuff out there trying to shoot you and once you are off of this elevator you cross here make it make it make it let's go all right and then it's gonna put you on another elevator and it's gonna try to make you focus on like pretty much just going straight like it'll point you the direction you're supposed to go for the actual mission but instead of going forward, you're going to want to go backwards. I actually pointed this out in uh, my let's play because I just assumed there was going to be something through the doors. I kind of figured that they would hide a uh, golden bolt over here. Just sneak your way through all this or kill them. Whatever you decide to do. Oop, I missed. Oh, I almost died. I always hear this.
All right, now we're on planet Veldin, the last planet and the last three bolts. First one's going to be here. It's a pretty line linear like level, so you'll get here eventually. It'll be right here where you fight a bunch of enemies right here. There's like a plane thing that attacks you, her ship. But you want to come over here to this little blue thing with a taunter. Oh, that's the wrong button. And then make this little thing uh, step on the button and then you can kill it. And it should be right around this corner. All right. All right. Once you get to this area where you jumped across here and before you like swing over to the little cave area, you're going to want to turn around and you can jump on top of this last little hut looking thing. And there's like a little pathway that will lead you straight to a bolt. Boom. All right, next one is right here. It's going to be around like where you uh, swing over to that side and around this stupid crater that I fell in during your let's play. Anyways, once you get here, you can jump on top of this thing and then kind of glide around this little corner to this like floating hut. And then you can jump on this little grind well, which will take you to this secret little hidden area. And the bolt will be right here. And that should do it. Is it going to pop up? There it is. All right. Well, if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful at all, please feel free to leave a like, comment and subscribe. It would really help me. Thank you so much.